Hey everybody, it's Joe from Heating Up. Uh, as you'll notice, my cohort Silas not here today. He's at school. I'm doing uh, a pretty exciting review today. Uh, really excited about this one, actually. Uh, this got sent to me by a friend of mine and a friend of the channel's, Court Kramer. Uh, he lives in Boca Raton, Florida. Um, I connected with him on Facebook and he actually sent me a one-off sauce. Um, just Joe it's called actually so that's pretty cool to me um, it's number one of number one so there's only one that was made so um, pretty cool pretty cool uh, I uh, have a list of ingredients that he sent me bear with me for a moment um, he emailed me a list of ingredients and uh, I'm gonna try and get this for you and read it so uh, he said in this is fermented garden grown peppers including habanero, scotch bonnets, red savina, fish, mad hatter, jalapeno, um, tabasco, ahi, rainforest, pineapple, golden serranos, purple ornamentals, and poblanos. And then he has also fermented the garlic, cloves, and onion. Bell or sweet peppers, green and red. Lemon lime juice, lemon and lime juice, sorry fire roasted tomatoes, a uh, touch of oil, hot mustard, sesame, and olive oil, and a mix of vinegars including white, white wine, red wine, rice, sherry, champagne, and balsamic. And he's got spices in here, uh, cumin, coriander, ginger, and some secret ones that he's not going to tell me about, um, and salt and pepper. Um, so yeah, uh, I think it's pretty cool he made this for me. Um, just Joe, uh, he did send me a little note, uh, said that if I wanted to get rid of the floor restrictor, um, which is what was on there, I could, which I already did. I am going to be tasting with my Chase the Heat hot sauce spoon, because I'm not going to be tainting my sauce, bro. Um, you can get these uh, at johnnyscoble.com, chasetheheat.com, I'll put a link in the description below. Um, they're mother of pearl spoons. They don't taint your, the flavor of the sauce, they don't change the flavor profile, and they are uh, they were used for rich people, caviar, they're dropping $100,000 uh, a serving of caviar, and this does not change or alter the flavor. I've actually done a taste test with a different sauce with this spoon and then a stainless steel spoon. I did a taste test, I did a smell test, and it's, it's amazing what the flavor how the flavor changes just from a stainless steel to to this it's this is a game changer so if you haven't got yours go to johnnyswivel.com and uh, grab yours it's definitely makes tasting sauce so much better and a great experience so I'm gonna give this a little shake and like I said I already removed the floor restrictor um, oh man the smell it's amazing I smell all the peppers. I can definitely smell the vinegars. Uh, and the spices, I can smell the coriander. It just, it smells delicious. Um, so here we go, I'm gonna give this a taste. Again, this was made for me by my friend Court Kramer. He is in Boca Raton, Florida. You can look him up on Facebook. I'm not sure what he has or if he's making sauces. For sale, but you can definitely check him out on uh, Facebook, Court Kramer, K O R T K R A M E R. And I will put a link in the description to his page uh, on the bottom of this video. So here's the pour. Oh, yeah. Oh, love the consistency, and I'm spilling, so I'm going to put this right in my mouth now. Wow. That is really, really delicious. Definitely tastes the habaneros, the scotch bonnets. A little throat burn, but nothing that's, nothing too crazy. Wow, that's really good. I'm gonna take one more. Consistency's great on this. Yeah, 
this bottle is not going to last long. It's going to be great on chicken, fish, steak. This would be a great salad dressing actually. Pizza, pasta. This is a really good sauce. Definitely got a little burn to it. It's not crazy hot. If you're uh, if you're chilly head chasing the heat, like Johnny says, you know, it's probably going to be for me. For me, it's probably a two or a three. Um, you know, if you don't eat hot stuff at all, it's going to probably be a seven or an eight. It's definitely got some kick to it. But yeah, this is great, Court. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. Um, yeah, like I said, give him a shout out. Um, he made this for me. Great. Um, appreciate you. I appreciate you a lot and, uh, hope everything's good in Florida and hope you guys are safe. And, um, like I said, there'll be links in the description below and I don't know what me and Silas have planned today. I know he wants to do a video, so we might do one. Uh, tonight when we get out when he gets out of school but um, Anyway, uh, I'm just gonna wrap this up now. I am Joe oh, Silas is not here and this has been a Review of court Kramer's just Joe one-off sauce. This is heating up. Hope you have a great day